Hey everyone, welcome to Spin the J Web with the Crypto Spider. In this video, we're going over the Cadena Mining Club NFT mining project on the Cadena Network. This project will always kind of hold a little special place in my heart because I'd been aware of Cadena for months, but I'd never really got involved with the community or any of the other projects. And this was the first NFT project I found and it kind of led me down a rabbit hole to find all the other ones, which led me to get more involved with the community and led me to make this channel and all these videos. So big shout out to Cadena Mining Club. I appreciate them for kind of getting me started on this journey, but I really love this project and I want to do a quick rundown of it to show everybody all about it. All right. Let's go. All right, so let's check out their website, kdamining.club. You'll notice they have FAQ, roadmaps, and white papers. I'll go over all that in a minute. Your one-stop shop for hash rate on Kadena, community-driven ASIC mining. So this is a mining project. They're actually buying KDA miners, and the people who buy the NFTs get a certain portion of the hash rate, which leads to a certain amount of KDA being paid out every month. Kadena Mining Club DAO. The Kadena Mining Club is a collection of 10,000 cryptocurrency mining themed NFTs built on Kadena. Buying a KMC NFT grants you ownership of a mining hash rate on the Kadena network and access to our DAO. The DAO will allow holders to vote on upcoming Kadena improvement with proposals, participate in giveaways, vote on infrastructure upgrades, and more. Why buy a KMC NFT? At Mint, each NFT represents 300 gigahash of mining power. To learn how much that yields, check out the calculator. I'll go over that in a minute. Every NFT represents one vote in the DAO, which will influence the future of the Kadena Mining Club. 10 lucky individuals will mint one of our ultra rare NFTs, which come with the prize pool totaling $250,000. And they gave a couple of hints on what some of that might be. When the DAO has more funds to purchase more miners, your NFT acts as a VIP pass to buy more mining power at a discounted rate. Members of the DAO will gain exclusive access to giveaways, contests, and our community channels. So what's it cost? There's 10,000 total, 1,500 are reserved for whitelist, but 200 each. The remaining 8,500 will be 300 each. To get whitelisted, you can join Discord or follow on Twitter. They do a lot of giveaways and a lot of things for experience points, which ranks you up and your rank depends on how many NFTs you can buy. And I'll go over that in a minute as well. 75% of mint proceeds will go towards buying ASICs, which will be procured in bulk to secure the best possible price. 16% will go to paying the team salary, along with everything involved in setting up a large-scale ASIC mining facility. And the 9% will go to giveaways to the Lucky 10 NFT holders. So you see the distribution chart here. FAQs, I'm gonna go over all of these. What is mining? What's an ASIC miner? What's an NFT? What is a DAO? What do I need to buy mint a KMC NFT? So first you'll need a wallet. I've done some videos on the wallets. They recommend X wallet. I do as well. I like how it functions. After you have your wallet set up, you'll need to fund it with the amount of Kadena that you would need to buy, whether you're whitelist or doing the public sale. And there'll be more detailed guides found in the Discord server. So after I mint, where does it go? It'll be sent to the wallet address and you'll be able to view it on marmalade.art once that platform launches. When is the mint? Whitelist is August 20th. 24 hours later is the public sale. I'll go over this in a second. What are the perks of being whitelisted? How can I get whitelisted? Being whitelisted guarantees you one mint at $200 in the first batch of NFT mints. You can get whitelisted by winning giveaways or by joining Discord and interacting with the community. They do Twitter raids and all kinds of games and random trivias and stuff. So just being active in their Discord or being plugged into their Discord could get you a whitelist pretty easily. How much does 300 giga hash generate? So you'd need to go to minor stat calculator. This 300 giga hash is already there. You'll make sure it's a zero pool fee and a zero electricity cost because that's being taken care of in the facility that's hosting them. So you'll see per NFT, you'll basically get almost four and a half KDA a month. So at current prices, that's a little under $9. Doesn't seem like a lot now, but it does give you that passive income. If KDA has a good future, like we all hope, that four and a half a month accumulating over time could be pretty nice. And if you're able to buy more than one NFT, let's say you can get three. So now you're receiving 13 and a half KDA a month. Roadmap, I'm not, I won't go over all this for the sake of time. Y'all can come here and read all this or pause the video. I will say no later than 12 months after Mint, they're going to plan on getting some more miners. So as the Dow Treasury builds up, they're going to try to go out and get more miners and then be able to give people that own the NFTs a higher hash rate at a discount so you can increase the rate that you're getting every month. Here's the team. Now, I do want to give a huge shout out to a member of the team that's not on here. That's their community manager, Nougat. Their Discord's amazing. He's very active in there, doing a lot of stuff to get people XP to try to get them up, levels to get more mints. Personally think when it comes to community managers, he's a legend. 
Next at the top, I'll click white paper. I won't go over all of this, but here's the white paper if you want to read through. Talks about the DAO, mint distribution, what is mining, smart contracts, a little bit more information on the DAO. Here's their roadmap. This is something I did want to talk about though. This is just an example scenario. Six months after miners are activated, let's assume the DAO has a million USD. They will do a vote to decide to purchase more miners with that money. Then they can add an extra 100 giga hash of mining power to each NFT. They'll have to opt in to receive it. And then once those miners are turned on, they'll start receiving that extra hash rate rewards. So income distribution, and they go into Kadena, frequently asked questions. The team, which there's new group there. And then of course, glossary and other stuff. So, so that's a quick glance at the white papers. Next, we'll check out the Founders Pass dashboard in their marketplace. Their Founders Pass was dropped just a few days ago. It was 420 of them. First come, first serve type of thing. They were 84.2 KDA a piece. The benefits of having one is you get a free mint which is $300 value, free future mints, a chance at winning a KD Box Pro, which is a Kadena Miner, Tech Lab airdrop. So the Tech Lab is them building their own facility where they're gonna be experimenting with using immersion technology and overclocking the miners. So by having one of these passes, it gives you first chance into that. So your NFT will be tied to those miners, which could be getting a higher hash rate and more rewards. You get boosted the KD6 rank, which will give you three whitelist spots, access to VIP merch, and if you decide to do your own project, they'll actually give you support on that project, which is pretty cool. So they do have a marketplace and there are some of these selling. You'll see the cheapest now is 144 KDA. So they're up a good bit at, from the mint price. For some of those perks, like the free mint, you need to own two of them. So if you wanted to get all the perks of the Founders Pass, you would have to have two. So you're looking at 289 KDA if you wanted to have one of these. And here are my two that I minted. I was really excited to get these. Next, we'll check out their Twitter. They're pretty active here. They do a lot of giveaways and collabs with other projects. Here's their Discord link, but you'll notice a link tree here. There's their marketplace and dashboard, which I just showed. Twitter, the website, which I showed first. I'll show the Discord in a minute and their Telegram. And then you can buy Kadena on Coin Metro. So it's at Kadena Mining Club. Come here and follow them and turn on notifications to be updated with their tweets. Just to mention, they have a huge poker tournament. I think there's 18 different projects on KDA. All these that are going to be joining in and get a free entry. It's August 6th at 20 UTC. First place prize is a KD Box Pro. KMC has actually partnered with Gold Shell to sell a limited number of KMC boxes. They have a KMC logo on the side of them. They're special made for this project. They haven't released too many details on when those are going to go on sale, but they should be pretty soon. But they're also doing a few more giveaways for the KD boxes. One of those being a video competition. Obviously, I'm going to put this video in the competition. So if you like my content, I would appreciate a vote. If you do end up buying Founders Passes, make sure to go to the Marketplace, connect your wallet and connect to Discord so that they can verify that you have them so that they can boost up your rank and get you into the giveaways and things like that. Make sure that you're getting all the benefits from those. So next I'll show you their Discord. Currently a little over 1,700 people in here. There's 668 people whitelisted. You'll see whitelist price public price, supply, mint date, team, reaction roles, links. Here's some sneak peeks. And some of these are animated. I love it. Some nice artwork. We have announcements, general chat. You got your founders patch. You can get into the founders lounge. Here's the video competition that I'm entering. Socials roadmap, more founders pass info. Here's how to minor list. Kind of tells you some things that you can do to level up, but I'll show you this as well. It lets you know if you get to level 10 in the discord, you get KD2 one minute. 20 is 2 minutes, 30 is 3, 40 is 5, 50 is 10. KD8s also get special bonuses. They can get into the tech lab and some other things. I believe they're going to select 12 people that are KD8s, somewhere in the top 12 in the server, the ones that have been the most helpful to be on a council, give ideas, things like that. So that should be pretty neat for those people. Congratulations to them. They all deserve it. This is their KD8 Be Great. This is just a system where they're trying to get more social media exposure. And as they do, they're going to do giveaways. So the higher your rank, the more entries you get into those giveaways. For example, if you're KD7, 
you'll get raffles in the KD2, 5, 6, and the 7 raffle. And this is what it is. You know, they'll, they'll give away different things. It goes a little further. So the more followers they get, the more rewards that they'll be given out. KMC Economy is where you can come in and do, as you see, work and collect. They have different prizes you can win, like custom-made desk lamps for KDA and KMC, Kitty Cat and Kadena Bulls NFTs. There's some pretty cool stuff they're giving away by participating in the KMC Economy. They also do promo quest or they'll basically tell you to do a Twitter raid. You go to Twitter and you do everything they say. You come in here and click here. This will pop up, click here and click upload a file. You take a screenshot of it and put it here. That'll show them that you've done what they ask and they give you XP. That XP leads to more levels. The higher the level, the higher your KD rank, more whitelist, more mining NFTs. If you're just here and active, doing the Twitter raids and having some conversations and playing games. And they do all kind of trivia almost every night, just asking questions or guess the logo or whatever it might be. They'll give you a few thousand XP for the correct answer. That gets you up there really quick. And then they have a few more channels I won't go over. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video. I really like the utility behind this project because it basically gives you a passive income in mining KDA. Obviously not financial advice, but I think a lot of people in this space think KDA is going to be a big thing in the future. Knowing that you have something that's going to be a steady income of that could be something worth holding. I appreciate all the support from the community. If you like my content, please like the video, leave a comment, subscribe to my channel, turn on notifications, retweet my link, and vote for the video in the KMC promo video contest. Much love, everyone.